me Isn't in my birthday yet Cause I gotta say You're looking like a gift for me Wrapped up nice and neat, baby Get in my way now, don't be shy We'll be here dancing day and night Get in my groove now, don't be shy Cause I got this list of my favorite things You could be the part I don't really need a new friend, so Spend your time with me Looking for someone who can play though Wanna hang with me I'm not really looking for a friend So spend your time with me Looking for someone not afraid of Give it all to me Get next to me, get next to me All that I want is to get next to you Get next to you Not asking for much but it feels like the two of us are golden or gold You see, what do you got to so take a chance Take a chance on me It's magical when you are close So get closer, babe What do you got cause I am golden I'm golden You're not really looking for a friend So at the top for me Never thought the loving would be easy But it's all for free Won't cost a thing So it's yours, worth the try Oh, this is the real thing I'm down Hey guys, so I just got home from work It is Friday, April the 28th but you guys will be seeing this video on a Thursday, May the 4th. So if you guys are Star Wars people, may the 4th be with you. So it is raining cats and dogs outside right now. Like pouring rain as you guys saw when I was leaving work. And I'm glad that I took a like small little video clip yesterday. My husband, it's been about a year now that I've been asking for it. I bought the spider net thing from Sam's Club but he needed like an extra pair of hands um, to actually hang it up from our oak tree in the backyard. So his dad came over yesterday and helped him to hang it up and Elijah was so ecstatic. I was gonna show you guys today, but I'm glad I took that clip yesterday. So I'll go ahead and roll that for you guys. The big thing that I alluded to maybe like two vlogs ago, I'm gonna go ahead and tell you guys now since today's my last day of work basically. So basically another company bought the company that we were working for before and all of us got significant pay cuts. So I got like a four dollar pay cut from where i was i've been with the company since 2011 so um i've been with them for about like 11 12 years now and i've been full-time with the company for going on eight years now some people have been like 15 going on 18 years for some people so it's like a big slap in the face for a lot of us who have been like loyal to this company i guess the good news out of all of this is that they're also cutting overtime there's no more minimal moderate like significant overtime whatsoever you cannot work more than 40 hours so um, we're going to be squeezing more patients in less time essentially, but being able to go in and get out within eight hours will obviously allow me to be more at home and more present with the kids, my family, and any of the activities that are going on. So I guess that is a plus if you kind of look at it that way. So I just got this in the mail from Amazon. So if you guys wear braces, this is definitely something that you should pick up. The people at the orthodontist office definitely recommended this. It is water pick, water flosser, because there's just no way I can use the toothpick flosser or the regular flosser to like actually get in between the braces. So I'm excited to go ahead and open this up. Kiddos are here chilling. Friday is when they can start getting on their electronics. So Harper is on her Kindle. What are you playing? Or watching? YouTube? 
but it's not even playing. Okay, I'll take a look at it. We can figure it out. No worries. And Elijah over here is playing Nintendo Switch and just <laughs> he's he's going from game to game to game. So I got myself the what's the game called again? Animal Crossing. Animal Crossing game. I like how you got yourself the game. <laughs> But you never remember the name. I know, and I've yet to play it. So Peyton, Harper, and Elijah have all played it. I think this weekend I'm going to go ahead and set up my account and get to it. So, But right now, while they're playing and relaxing, we're going to get dinner in the oven. And then I'm going to go ahead and start picking up the living room here. You only call me on the weekends when you're out and about. Only chasing highs you need me. He brings me flowers on a tube. Gives me good love and something that I never thought existed I know what I need, ain't gonna lie I know what I want, speak in my mind now The queen needs a king to be by her side All my mind's loving's on my mind He can do me better, he can do me better All my mind's everything I like I don't know if it's supposed to rain anymore today, but Harper was supposed to have a softball game. Today would have been her second softball game, but the fields are completely wet, so they went ahead and canceled it like late last night, I think. So, um, but it was nice to get a heads up on that. 
But I wanted to tell you guys, if I didn't already, I think I'm probably gonna put something like in the beginning of this video. This is a collaboration video. It's a Mother's Day tribute video. So please check out my description box below. There's gonna be a lot of ladies um, that are gonna be participating in this. So be sure to check out their videos so that way you can see what they're all getting up to today. My plan for my Mother's Day tribute video was to be outside. It has been like, really nice the past couple of weeks i'm talking like mid 70s to like mid 80s and of course the day that i want to do this video it is just nasty outside so i had planned on going out getting my vegetable beds ready i had um things that i had planned on planting and that may not work out so we'll see what i end up doing today i am not really sure but I've been up for a while now. I got up at seven o'clock. The kids were up at six o'clock, as always. I'm telling you guys, like during the week, it's a struggle getting them up for school. And then Saturday and Sunday, they're like roosters and they're up like at the crack of dawn. So, but it's eight o'clock now, um, going on 8.30. We're gonna be trying to get to the gym. The sand play is open and I'm gonna try and get a workout in. Peyton just got up now, he's over there. I'm his. awake. <laughs> he didn't sleep very well last night, so I let him sleep in. But he's making his protein drink, and then we're gonna go ahead and head to the gym um, and get a couple's workout in. Also, I forgot to tell you guys that I sprained my knee. Where's my, where'd I put it? Oh, I think it's over here. I sprained my knee, my right knee, and I did this like on April the 17th. They did at work transferring a patient, so I'm limping right now. I have to wear this brace, and for a good like week, I was also having to use a crutch, especially in the parking lot at work because it's long and uphill, leaving work, and then downhill going into work. So I'm off the crutch now, and then I have this brace that I have to wear for most of the day. I take it off when I get to the house. But when I'm moving about at work and then just out of the house, I do have this on just to give my knee some more stability. I've been going to physical therapy. I've been getting more range of motion in my knee, but any kind of twerking, twisting and turning of my knee literally like stops me in my tracks and it just feels like it's gonna give out. It does give out actually. So I'm supposed to be getting an MRI on Monday, May the 1st, to see if it's more of a uh, meniscus issue, and then we'll go from there. So an hour later, we finally made it to the gym, but this is the machine that I have been using as of lately since I hurt myself. You guys know that I usually use the elliptical machines over there, but this one still allows me to get in a good cardio workout, although I do have to stay on it for a while to get the burn that I want. home now and even though Harper does not have her softball game I wanted to show you guys kind of like her softball attire and equipment you guys already know when I showed you in one of our vlogs like her 
softball mitt and then her softball and then the bat. I still do need to put her names on there because she's got three other girls that have the same bat and glove as she does. But I got this from Amazon. This is like a carrying bag. It's got a side over here, a strap and a um, mesh over here to put her bat in. And then the inside of it is really deep to put any kind of equipment that she has like her softball and her mitt. And this is kind of big for her for now. So I have to pull the straps all the way up but I think she'll definitely grow into it and then here is her cute little uniform so their team name are the Blue Jays and it's like a tie-dye color here's her socks over here so they supply the top and then the socks and then I just went on Amazon and bought these black pair of softball pants for her so but this is her attire so hopefully the weather looks better for next weekend for her game all right, so because it's gonna rain like in the next hour to hour and a half, and I'm not gonna have enough time to get everything done, I think my best bet is just to try and weed. So um, I don't think I told you guys, but like when I was younger, I did not like garden. I didn't like planting flowers, none of that. But my stepmom absolutely loved it. And I think just working with her in the garden just made me like enjoy it as an adult. And then also my mother-in-law, I'm gonna try and have her maybe like send me a picture so I can put it on the screen for you guys. But her flower beds are like immaculate. And then when we did live with them um, years ago, like 10 years ago maybe 12 now but we ended up having a vegetable garden on our side of the house so um that's what like my mother's day tribute kind of is is that like i just like feel like that's something that like the three of us have in common so since we've been living in this house i think it'll be like maybe 10 years now um that we're coming up we have done um, I think a really good job on like planting flowers and just having our own vegetables every single year. So I'm not quite sure yet what I'm gonna plant this year. I'm gonna talk to my husband and then talk to the kids to see what they wanna plant this year. But last year our vegetable garden did not do well because we didn't do a very good job of fertilizing the soil. So I'm gonna go ahead and pull all the weeds out and then in another vlog, I will go ahead and show you guys like how we fertilize the soil and then what vegetables Vegetables we end up planting. Let me level with you. Let me be in your crew. I just want to be free. Be with people like me. I'm so not in the mood to be broken and blue. I just want to go dance. Baby, find me some moments. I don't want to talk tonight. I don't want to waste another night. I just want to hit the floor. Maybe somewhere I haven't been before I don't wanna kill the vibe I don't wanna feel it if it don't feel right I just wanna break the ice vegetable beds are completely done and that makes me so happy I did my best to try and weed around like the perimeter where the rocks are but that was really hard you guys saw that like Elijah was more of a bigger helper than Harper was he likes getting messy digging in dirt all that jazz Harper on the other hand could care less so she helped for like a minute or two and then she went right back to swinging on the swing so but that was fine so that's done hopefully
hopefully by the time next weekend rolls around, I can do a little bit more outside with Peyton. And then hopefully we'll be able to plant some of the vegetables that I'm thinking I have in mind. We'll see. But I went ahead and washed my hands. I need to go ahead and make the kids their lunches. It's about one o'clock now. But I didn't want to give you guys a heads up on my mom or an update rather for a lot of you that were asking and many of you I know were thinking of her um, and praying for her. So she did leave my facility this um, previous, was it Monday? Um, a few days ago, I think it was. So Monday is when it was. So she went back to the Eastern Shore and um, she ended up going to an assisted living facility. So this is the one that my brother and I had in mind for her. Um, it's a really good place, really good caregivers and administrators all in all. So this week she's kind of been settling in um, and just kind of adjusting. It's a big shock for her obviously with not being able to return back to her house. But all in all, as far as her safety, she does need a 24 hour care regarding like self care, bathing, dressing, toileting, um, mobility, and then also like meal management and then also medication management as well. So this facility is the best place for her. So that way she can get the care that she needs. So for all those of you that were thinking of her and praying for her, I really appreciate it. But that is an update on how she's doing. Um, she's settling in pretty well this week, I would say. time to sort out all the fights yeah. to sort out all the lies oh baby yeah oh, no. there was a part of me that knew that and still i'm caught by surprise oh. i thought you'd always be mine oh yeah i guess our dreams fell asleep there's no passion in the comatose yeah. baby going down 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 yeah. baby going down 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 yeah. tried so hard Keep moving like the river goes yeah. Baby, going down, 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 down Yeah, yeah. yeah. And I thought It's time I'm letting you go This time I know it for sure I just thought I should let you know yeah. Show me what it's like to be circling among the clouds Because without you by my side I would be stuck here on the ground You're lighting up the way I can see the road ahead of me I won't be stumbling in the dark Your eyes are shining like the stars I was down Until you saved me Until you set me free My eyes were closed Now I see clear as day and I just wanted to say That you can take me high Feels like I can fly You can take me high I can see the sun staring at you when you make that smile I'm moving closer to you now I can't get close enough somehow And I was down Until you saved me Until you set me free My eyes were closed <laughs> So we're all done and this one is Elijah's We went ahead and put three checks on the ones that he really wanted to share So the first one is <laughs> My favorite food that my mom makes is what's my what's your favorite food that I make? The and two food, favorite. And spaghetti and meatballs. And what else? What's Indian the other one? Food? You told me African food and I wrote it down. Uh, Indian food too? I don't know how to make Indian food, but I know how to order it. <laughs> I know how to. And then he also wanted to share the funniest thing my mom does is make silly faces. And I love it when my mom says goodbye to me and gives me a kiss and, hug. and a hug and <laughs> what about you Harper what do you want to share okay so um the first one that I wanted to share um for mommy uh -huh. is her favorite wait no um, mom always says cut that out 
when, when y'all are fighting, that is true. Uh, no, I, no, uh, yeah. What and else? Then, and then my favorite food that my mom makes is African food. And and then the last one is the funniest thing my mom does is say stinky butt. <laughs> well, yeah, when somebody farts. <laughs> and you guys, you guys sign this for me. Harper, age. Well, you're more than seven and a half. You only got one more month to go until you I turn eight. How old am I? So you're like you're like a month. You're you're seven. You're seven years and twelve months. No, seven years and eleven months old. So you're close. I'm gonna save this from you, and then I'm gonna save this from Elijah as well. All right, guys, so I have moved on now. I am making a breakfast casserole for tomorrow. And because I am going out tonight with my friends, I needed to make it tonight so that way I can get it going tomorrow morning. So over here, I have the hash browns. They're cooking. They've been cooking for about two minutes now, so I have about another eight to ten more minutes before they're done. And then the sausage is already done the directions for this recipe was not very clear i got it from pinterest so i'll make sure i link it below for you guys it wasn't clear whether or not to put the patties already like in the casserole dish or to chop it up so i just went ahead and decided to chop it up i figured that would be easier for us to just eat but yeah so i've been at this for about 30 minutes now my husband had to go back to the grocery store and get the sausage because we did not have enough but yeah so i'm gonna go ahead and get this together and put it in the refrigerator so that way i'll have that ready for tomorrow for breakfast let me let go with you let me be in your crew i just want to be free be with people like me Broken and blue I just wanna go dance Baby, find me some romance I don't wanna talk tonight I don't wanna waste another night I just wanna hit the floor Maybe somewhere I haven't been before I don't wanna kill the vibe I don't wanna feel it if it don't feel right I just wanna break the ice There's so much more to So I'm finally ready for the day and it's like six o'clock in the afternoon, but I'm getting ready now to go out with my friends. So I went ahead and took a shower and this is my first time wearing this bodysuit. The tag was still on it and I've had it for like probably eight months now and it's had a babaton, but I cannot for the life of me remember where I got it from. I know it was online somewhere. So I have this on. You guys have probably seen these jeans before. This is from the brand Wild Fable at Target. And then I've got my sandals on. I'm not quite sure if I should wear my knee brace. Um, I probably should, but I feel like it's not gonna look very good with the whole outfit. I don't know, so. Hi, Elijah. <laughs> you wanna say hi? Yeah. Okay. Hi, friends. Anything else you want to say? Yeah. So when it's you got it back up so they can see you. When so when so the short hand is only on the six. The twelve. The the big hand has to go on the twelve. Uh huh. And then it will be time for us to get on technology. That's basically in one more minute. So go back downstairs and check. <laughs> So yeah, this is the outfit. All right guys, so I went ahead and put on a jean jacket because I just needed something over my shoulders. And then also when I go like out and about like in restaurants and stuff, it's cold for me. So I needed something over my shoulders. But um, before I got ready, I went over to Target because it's like two weeks late or like 10 days late actually. My sister-in-law's birthday is on April the 19th, but we just now all got a chance to get together. 
So tomorrow we're getting together to celebrate her birthday and I wanted to go to Target and pick up a few things. So I think I did a good job of picking things that I think she would like. So I went ahead and did that and I did take a look at some few things for Elijah for his birthday but I haven't quite decided on some things yet. But for tonight, we were supposed to be going to this place called Nacho Mama's and I have not been there in such a long time and I was really looking forward to it but one of my friends called to make a reservation for us because there were supposed to be six maybe seven of us going tonight but they were all booked because they have a reception for a wedding so I'm glad that she actually called to do that. So we're going to be going to this place called McFalls or McFowls, I'm not sure, but it'll be a new place for us, um, or at least for me. One of our friends just messaged us like an hour, hour and a half ago. Um, she's not able to come because she's going to be going to her grandmother's to visit her. But other than that, I'm really looking forward to seeing everyone. The last time they got together was maybe like two months ago, but things were going on with my mom, so I wasn't able to make it either. So I'm really looking forward to this. But if you guys did enjoy today's video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. Um, I hope that you guys enjoyed this Mother's Day tribute of some sort kind of vlog. I did my best trying to get out there with the weather to um, get my garden ready. I really wish that I would have had the time and also um, weather permitting to be able to like plant everything I want to. But as long as I get it done in the next two weeks, I feel like I should be good to go. So, but anywho, um, I hope that you guys enjoyed this video and i will see you guys in the next one i'm heading out now for dinner and drinks and i'm so excited let me let go with you let me be in your crew i just want to be free be with people like me i'm so not in the mood to be broken and blue i just want to go dance baby find me some more I don't wanna waste another night I just wanna hit the floor Maybe somewhere I haven't been before